let us discuss about the uh, opportunity uh, infections in HIV. We know that opportunistic infections in HIV occur when CD4 count is less than 500. When the count is more than 500, there are no opportunistic infections. So uh, this is all about memorizing uh, CD4 count when it is less than 500 cells per microliter. Uh, the most common infections are tuberculosis, oropharyngeal candidiasis, bacterial pneumonias, and uh, there are a few more that must be memorized. Uh, one of them important is non-Hodgkin's lymphoma. Second is Kaposi sarcoma. Uh, third is herpes zoster virus. So that uh, that is uh, the infections that occur when CD4 count is less than 500. When CD4 count is less than 200, the infections that occur are pneumocystis gyrovisiae pneumonia or the newer name pneumocystis carinae pneumonia, esophageal candidiasis. So we can you know make out the difference here here there was the oropharyngeal candidiasis right and here there is esophageal candidiasis so this is not to be confused between the esophageal and oropharyngeal candidiasis right the third is the hiv wasting syndrome in which there is more than 10 percent uh, loss of body weight in hiv infected individuals a few more important uh, infections that are, that need to be memorized are isospora belli diarrhea we know that this is notorious for causing chronic diarrhea in hiv second is hiv associated dementia again very very important When CD4 count is less than 100, uh, the infections that are common are cerebral toxoplasmosis, cryptococcal meningitis, that is very very common in, in, in patients who present to us with meningitis and they are HIV positive. I think it is always mandatory to do uh, a cryptococcal antigen in, in the CSF. Third is the CMV infection cytomegalovirus. Fourth is the, uh, again, there are a few notorious organisms which are known for causing chronic diarrhea. They are cryptosporidiosis. They are microsporidiosis. Right. Then there is disseminated MAC. that occurs then very very important that needs to be memorized when there is gd4 count less than 100 and that is uh, pmle progressive multifocal leukoencephalopathy see disseminated mac occurs in occurs when cd4 count is less than 100 also and it also occurs when it is less than 50 also but always remember it occurs more when it is less than 50 right other two infections which are common when cd4 count less than 50 is cmv and toxoplasma gondii so that was all about opportunistic infections in hiv thank you so very much